Hey friends, welcome to One Flight Down Basement Beer Tastings, and today we are looking at another beer from Breakwall Brewing in Port Colborne, Ontario. All right, so this is another beer I got from my buddy Shane at Shane's Craft Beer Review. Uh, he sent me a few from uh, Breakwall Brewing recently. Uh, I've tried a few, they're pretty decent beers. Um, they're in Port Colborne, Ontario, which is kind of like right down by the US border in the Niagara Falls area. Uh, so not probably not somewhere I'm gonna get to on this upcoming uh, trip that I have uh, later this week um to Ontario. I'm going down to Toronto and I'm gonna I'm gonna visit uh Drew in uh in Brantford. Uh I might hit Barry. I don't know. I don't know where we're going exactly, but uh I don't think I'm hitting the Niagara area this time, but maybe next time. Maybe next time. And this uh judging by the beers I've had so far might be a good place to go. Uh this one is called Nine O'clock Whistle. It's an India Pale Ale. It is six percent alcohol. Let's crack it open, see what it's all about. Oh, look at that, it's like a beer commercial dripping down over my hand. All right, here we go. Oh yeah, this is a mess. I'm just getting beer all over my leg. Um, but that's okay, so it's a hot day and it feels nice and cool. Oh, it's gonna be just a sticky mess shortly. Uh, so what do we have here? A nice kind of golden looking IPA, a bit of activity going on there in the glass. So you can see it through the bubbles that are sticking on the side. There we go. Uh, huge head from my not so good pour. Unless I was, I just, just say I'm doing a hard pour sometimes and then that would forgive that, uh, that kind of pour. Um, not getting a ton on the nose. maybe a little bit of like a like a sweet fruitiness um yeah i don't know uh let's go in for a sip and see what we have All right, that's got a nice little bit of a hoppy bite at the end. Nothing overpowering at all. Um, pretty kind of basic IPA kind of taste. Uh, it's not like, you know, super overpowering on the, like the fruity citrusy notes or anything like that, um, but it's there. Um, and yeah, just that really nice little bite at the end. Um, yeah, that's a pretty darn decent beer. What did I say it was? 6% alcohol? Uh, what does it say on the can here? Uh, the time after World War II was an era of classic cars, kids playing kick the can, and riding Mustang bikes with banana seats. It was also the years of Port Colborne's nine o'clock curfew whistle. Hmm. The whistle rang from the fire, uh, fire hall downtown and was a signal for the kids to head home. It fell silent one night in the late 1970s, never to be heard again. Uh, Breakwall Brewing is a family-owned and operated uh, brewery in the heart of Port Colborne. Uh, Breakwall Brewing has restored a century-old tradition of brewing along the Lake Erie shoreline. We brew in small batches to ensure consistence, uh, consistently fresh beer using a mix of local hops and specialty grains. It really says much in terms of tasting notes or anything like that. Oh, it does say uh, deep citrus notes with floral aromas, uh, strong malt backbone, uh, rounded bitterness, and well balanced. Um, I mean, there's a bit of the citrus in there. I, I, I and I, uh, floral aromas. I, I was barely getting anything on the nose, to be honest. Uh, but I do get the maltiness up front, um, and then that nice bitter finish. It just yeah, I don't know. It's, it's like a very, very nice kind of like basic typical IPA yeah nothing wrong with this at all I 
yeah, that's a pretty decent beer. I, I could easily have a few of these. Uh, all right, Shane, thank you so much for uh, sending this beer out to me and uh, hope to see you real soon. Uh, everyone else, thank you so much for dropping by the Terry Isle patio. Uh, join me here again here real soon. All right, cheers, friends. Again, I'm tired and I need to go home.